Look, man, I'm about to tell y'all something that's really actually putting a gap in our community. Like, things could be a lot more better. Everybody can be a lot more, you know, collectively involved with each other. I mean, like, uplifting each other. If everybody acted as a community, bro, this, we could lit this shit up, like, every day like it's 4th of July. Like this, man, bro. But we too busy competing with each other. And you know where it all starts at? Winning. I know. That one concept. You would have thought it made you better, huh? You would have thought. But no. It's the reason why you at home at nighttime and can't fuck with nobody. Yeah. It's the reason why you feel like you can't talk to people. Yeah. It's the reason why you feel like you're all alone in this world. Yeah. Because we were taught to win. I, and I'm not saying just you. I'm talking about the person that you were involved with, whether it's family, relative, whether it's boyfriend, girlfriend, whether it's a shit, a motherfucker out on the streets, a mentor, anybody. That person has that one concept. You know what that is, huh? Do you know what that is? It's winning. They want to win. The record labels have that concept. Winning. P. Diddy, winning. I ain't never heard of Danny K again. I'm saying and I, I grew up in a household with all sisters, so they also they always be listening to that. And of course, you're gonna hear it in your background. So you you know say you like oh shit, you like oh shit, she got young Jock on the squad, winning. They all win, so they're willing to step over anybody else to do it, whether it's fi financially, where it's energetically, they trying to win, so they trying to steal your vibe. Whether it's uh, uh, personality wise, they're stealing your style. It's all about winning because they want to win. That's what it's all about. So they're willing to do anything to do it. They're willing to commit sins, which is what's going on right now. Niggas been committing sins to win. What you think they doing it for? What is the drive? What's the motivation? What is the what's the what's the, what's the prize at the end of the day? Right? What's the prize? But 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 if everybody that was trying to win will go out and just help that person, show love, gratification. You really think anybody will have to go without? You really think they'd be able to give 14 billion, 14.8 billion to other countries and say, fuck them motherfuckers out on these streets? I know, everybody. No, I know. But giving money to other people, setting them up shop, giving them free, giving them businesses when they come out here, homes, everything. But the motherfuckers, and I, okay, I said, I didn't go out there. Well, yes, technically I did. But my ancestors and my lineage built the foundation, therefore gave this structure to come in and profit off of it. That's why it matters. Damn. I shouldn't have to explain that to people, but of course I do. So, um, <clears throat> that's why it fucking matters. Because instead of, that's just supposed to be going to his motherfucking lineage. Who you think that is? It's supposed to go down the tree. I know you got a trust fund. Nah, I got to you gonna pay me some bills in my house. That's, that's what I got. <laughs> I'm like, what you mean? So, but you always got to show love. So, you know, so I'm telling y'all winning is like the most, whoo, bro, misunderstood motherfucker. It's that slider. It's like marijuana. You ain't going to know it's going to hit you, but it's going to hit you. Imagine everybody helping out the women and children. You really think dudes going to be growing up feminized? You really think dudes going to grow up putting their hands on females? Nah. It wouldn't be like that. I guarantee you. Because everybody is helping themselves. Like they did in the 50s before they intervened. And then after that, it just went downhill. Facts, data, statistics. Check it out. But if people were more on the mindset of like, why, do, why am I pushing to be the one when everybody can lift each other up and be one? I know. I know. I guarantee it's going to kill all crime, all violence. It's going to kill everything. And it's going to raise a vibration. And everybody are naturally high 24-7. Never thought about that. You don't have to pay You don't have to pay no drugs. I know. You naturally high off of other motherfuckers' energy. Your energy amplifying. I know, right? Nigga, this is beyond niggas' mindset, so they can't conceive this shit. But I'm like, what do you think it was like? How do you think they was able to put... Lynching, all that shit, and our community still thrive and build black Wall Streets, banks, uh, invent like almost everything in fucking America and British and all them shit. 
like almost everything, stoplights, phones, batteries, TVs, all the hair, makeup, all, you know, whatever, all this, you know, not the toot the horn, but you got to throw credit where it's due. You can't not not give such and such credit talking about be humble. What the? What, were they humble? Were these humble? Was the uh, cockroaches humble? Nah, they weren't humble at all. I don't think so. Niggas was flaunting shit that they never had. Everything that they did, meaning I'll say, I won't throw out names, but everything that they did, illegal. Illegal. If you want to find out, don't ask me. Go check their system. It's there. They have to be honest with themselves. Just you, you don't know. You believe what some TikTok or some Instagram told you. So now, you know what I'm saying? But what is that due to? Winning. Winning. People, these motherfuckers fucking with our planet wants to win. What do you think they're doing that for? Winning. What do you think? I'm telling you, everything does. Everything that's going on right now is because that one concept, that one thing that everybody is willing to do some sinful shit over. Nah, I'm cool. I'll sit in the back. I ain't finna get in that because that shit messy. But mostly everybody. Not everybody. But you can tell in the eyes. So don't try to play me. That's why I be like, let me see your eyes. Let me see your eyes. Let me see your eyes. Just hold on still. If you twitching and shit, then you got a lot of shit that you don't want to get out. All right? I'm just saying. Most of the time, when I look at people's eyes, you can feel everything, bro. That shit sucks, man. You can feel everything. So I don't even care about that. But look, let me finish. Let me get off. Let me not get off topic. So winning. Winning is something that I would say let go right now. It's a new moon. Let that shit go. Right now is the time to heal and let stuff go. Let go of the concept of winning. I guarantee you're going to win a lot more in life. By you just having fun. That's winning. By you connecting. And I guarantee everything's just going to fall together. Because you're not thinking of it as, oh, I need to win. I need to win. Because it's throwing out that you're not winning. Most of the time, I guarantee, most people are throwing out the concept of not winning. I fell victim of this. I can't say I, I, I didn't do it. No, I did. Yes, I was trying to win for a little time period that I picked up from others that I view as, oh, man, they're winning. I'm going to win too. And then I stopped real fast. I saw what it did, and I was like, you know what? Let me stop this. You know, you got to get dirty when you want to win. You got to get dirty. And me, I feel like being me is winning. <laughs> being you is already winning. I know. I know. Being you is winning. What if I told you that? Oh, this is uh, ginger, turmeric, lime, you know, with a little bit of tea. I don't put too much tea, but unless it's herbs, all that shit's artificial anyway. But yeah, I like the potency of these uh, three things. A lot of minerals. Also, I put burdock root in it. You know, I got some burdock up over there. Let me show y'all. This right here is burdock. I know, right? It looks a little artificial. I don't know, right? But I'm gonna have I'm gonna just go to a different supplier next time. Taking minerals is winning. Taking care of your body is winning. But when you compete with somebody else, that's not winning. That's not winning at all. Because you have to project insecurities on someone else just to make you feel better. How is projecting lower vibratory emotions on somebody else? winning that's kind of losing to me because you're doing the opposite of what you're supposed to do is which is help thy planet help thy net well i mean uplift right now we we don't do we can't deal with no more people being fucked matter, matter of fact the planet's not even taking it the planet will not tolerate fuck shit at all so whatever put on the media of course i don't watch but whatever they put on the media you better already just foster just flip that shit and Duh, no, negative, like, yeah. bro, they can't, it's impossible, trust me, impossible, matter of fact, don't trust me, trust the planet, go outside and ground yourself, and let that speak for itself, I guarantee, if you're still trying to win, or trying to, uh, what's the word, it's not the fact that you're winning to feel, feel good either, it's the stuff that you're willing to do for it, that's what makes it such a low vibratory thing. That's what makes it so low. The things that you're willing to do to win 
it brings that whole shit down. It just brings it down bars. Like it's not up here where winning is uplifting people. People thinking winning is making no. They're literally trying to push and trying to belittle and rip apart and make someone else have problems that they now have to go to therapy or deal shadow work with. Shadow work is a form of therapy. If you're not doing shadow work, then you have to go to a therapist. Cause you're not gonna be able, you're gonna physically combust, bro. Physically combust. I'm telling you. So you have to either do shadow work or go to therapy. Or just denounce it and not give a shit. You know what I'm saying? Just get rid of that shit because you know what it is. There's multiple ways, but most people won't like that third option. Shit, me? What, what you think I do? Ha! So I'm telling y'all, try to just uplift more than win. And I guarantee you're going to win trying to uplift. Because you already winning because you're doing what winning is, which is uplifting. I know. I know. I know. So, shit, man, you can't make this shit up, though. You can't make this shit up.